Hello everybody, this is Dragonheart and welcome to another online battle for Total War Room 2. My opponent today is Wurses and he is playing as Rome and I am playing as Rome as well. And the one thing I should say about this battle is that the build that I'm using for this multiplayer battle is in fact the same build I used in the previous online battle. So you get to see how I do against a Roman faction and a different player this time. Um, this battle map, I believe, actually I remember now, this battle map I actually selected is a battle map which is near to where I live in Wales. So <laughs> we're actually fighting on Welsh soil at the moment. Although I suppose at the time it wasn't Wales as such, it was uh, one of the tri local tribes. The Silurian tribe, I believe, is the one which is nearest to me. So this is Silurian lands. <laughs> little history lesson there for you. Anyway, back to the video because it's probably a bad idea for me to try and teach you history because my history is crap. But I try my best whenever I can. So we have the same build as last time and I should say Wurses gave me a very good battle in this battle before I begin. He's a very good player from what I've seen of him so far. Um, <laughs> he's a lot better than me, <laughs> put it that way. Um, so I got my, my lovely gladiators there, look at them. Very beastly looking gladiators, reminds me of Spartacus, I love the Spartacus series. Fantastic uh, series by stars on TV and I actually own all of them on DVD as well. So yeah, if you, if you haven't seen Spartacus I suggest you watch it, it is fantastic. Lots of blood, lots of sex, so if you're a bit of a perv like me then you're probably going to love it. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm not really a perv. Well. <laughs> Okay, back to the battle, and we move our infantry to the left flank, we've moved our skirmishers and our missile troops forward in the centre. He's got a similar build to me actually, he has war elephants as well, he has some missile troops, some cavalry, so it's pretty pretty evenly matched builds I'd say. He's gone to the far right side of the battlefield, I've moved my cavalry to try and flank around him. And I also I should say, you've probably already noticed it, but I've actually forgotten to put the the unit flags back on again so it does get a bit confusing but I will try my best to let you know what's happening with my commentary right now um, I do actually change the flags in the next battle so don't worry it will be back to normal in the next battle um, so I flank around with my cavalry on the far right flank and you can see with the spacebar down you can see what I'm trying to do with all my units trying to flank him trying to encircle him try to do my own little Hannibal on him which of course <laughs> I'm more like Hannibal's goofy cousin when it comes to battles hardly like the legend himself <laughs> I wish I was like Hannibal though could certainly help me out in these battles but anyway he's bringing his elephants and his cavalry forward I'm bringing my cavalry to go past them to the far right flank I was hoping to try and flank around and perhaps make a run for his general um, slingers I'm trying to engage them right now bring all my infantry to the left flank as well I got a lot of infantry on the left flank so I should try to use that um, positively. The elephants I start charging as well. Put attack in test to on for my armoured legionaries. Um, and we are doing some damage right now. The giant ants are going again and I suppress the battle advisor. I, I really got to turn that off. I don't know why I haven't got it on. But as you can see I'm trying to select some units which are not even mine so it does get a bit confusing like this so I do recommend if anybody does fight an online battle, don't fight it like I'm doing because <laughs> it is very difficult to get away with it. And yeah, so we're engaging all of his units right now. Apart from my general, my general's still back at the battlefield. I always seem to forget my general. I always seem to leave him at the back and never get him involved. Something I need to try and improve on in the future. So I bring all my units forward now. He's brought his elephants in. I got my elephants in there as well. Do quite well on the left flank. All my units have seemed to have broken his one unit there. Balance of powers evenly matched, probably just in his favour at this point in time. I've still got quite a lot of fresh units on the battlefield, apart from my elephant and one of my slingers. My elephant's actually wavering, so that's not good. Just charging my cavalry in. I'm trying to make a run for his general. I turn Draco on as well, try and get that uh, cavalry effect going. His Velites are in position to be fired at by my skirmishing troops. They use Presence and Loyalty of the Tenth. Uh, the reason why I've got these abilities is because I picked, <coughs> oh, pardon me, I picked Caesar as my general on the on the uh, 
uh, selection screen for the units. I did notice that um, you know when you have warrior, commander, and strategist, if you play as the if you play as the Romans, you actually have uh, Caesar as a ability. So I thought I'd try it out in this battle to see what it does. All it really does is give you a couple of different special abilities. But as you can see, he's completely got the upper hand on me now. His units are completely decimated. My units. He still got his elephants. I've lost my elephants. Well, I actually I do still have them, but I've only got three of them, and they are engaged with his units at the moment. So it's not looking good for them. He's bringing his elephants in. Bring my triari in. Try and attack his Praetorian guard with my skirmishers. But he has the he has the man advantage now. I'm scattered all over the battlefield. It's just death everywhere. Look at all the dead bodies. Big massive pile of dead bodies on the battlefield. And yeah, he did he did give me a very good battle in this battle. Fair play to him. And that's pretty much it. <coughs> oh my god, a bad throat today, so I do apologise. But yeah, um I'm I'm slowly being decimated, and that's the end of the battle. So I hope you've enjoyed. I've been Dragonheart. I'll leave you with this end screen. Until next time, goodbye.